start on the floor with that outside leg in front, your insides coming up and over. Outside hand comes to the knee for that cheeky little pose. Grab back on the pole as you use your top knee to kick around the pole. Push up slightly and then drop all the way down to the ground, tuck all the way in. Straighten up your legs and you're going to go underneath your top arm as you push through on the pole with that hand. Bring yourself back down to the floor for a second. Outside hand comes out as you come up into a cartwheel. So inside leg kicks away, then your outside leg. And then hook on the pole inside, then outside. Lift those hips as you come through. You're going to reach up with that outside hand, up again with the other hand, and go into your martini seat. If you don't want to take your hands off, you don't have to. Keep them on the pole, that's fine. Grab back on, both hands come on. You're gonna lift your butt and come up to standing. From here, reach nice and high with that top arm, go into a straight leg cradle spin. Land inside, outside, turn back. Bottom hand comes off, goes by your bum. You're going to step around outside and then inside. From here, turn through the gap, adjust your top arm. And you're going to either go into that stag position, so cup grip lift, or you're going to do the leap that we did a few days ago. From here, land on the ground, your top arm becomes your inside arm as you go upside down again. Hook your outside leg into that outside leg hang just for a second. Then you're going to go into a hang glider, so your outside hand comes down into that hang glider position. Make sure you have a nice strong grip here. Your inside leg catches on the foot on the pole and you're going to turn into an archer. Or a side bow and arrow. Many names for these moves. I bring my free leg up so I can control this descent, so go nice and slowly tuck in and slow yourself down as much as you can coming down. Your hands stay the same way around, but they come off the pole to change grip position. Other hand comes down. Now if you struggle with handstand, you can cut this bit out, or you can go into it from a kick up, or you can lower from a crucifix position. So hook your inside leg, other leg comes behind. As you climb up, you're gonna reach behind that leg. Tuck through into a genie position. And then into a side superman. Reach across your body to stop the spin, but it'll probably spin a little bit. Grab back between your legs, come back into that genie position, reach above. Into another martini seat, this time you should be on your other side. Grab back onto the pole, hands come on. You're going to spin that straight leg behind the pole as you pull up. Hand goes down. You're going to go up and over into your Superman. Your bottom hand is going to come thumb down and you're going to come onto the same shoulder as that bottom hand. Your top hand then comes behind your bum, tuck underneath with that elbow, and you can go into this kind of planche position. You can either have one leg bent and one leg straight, or you can have both legs straight. This isn't the greatest angle, but it happens in the routine. <laughs> From here you're going to go into a shoulder roll, so the outside leg comes down first, tuck your head through, mind yourself on the pole as you come up. Your hand on the pole is going to become thumb up, push down in the ground and go into a little bunny hop. You're going to step down, reach really high with that outside hand. Turn backwards, you're going to hook what is now your inside leg. Reach your bottom hand behind your head, twizzle through, you're going to step on that straight leg, turn all the way through. Hook what is now your inside leg back into a genie spin, squeeze your legs on the pole, and pose to finish.